Hello again, this is a continuation of a video I made uh, a week ago, really, uh, about how to sharpen uh, chisels and other blades of this sort. And uh, I, in a video that has, I think it's called Dad's Hand Sharpening <laughs> System, I uh, showed how to grind the, the uh, edges of a chisel using the hand grinder. Well, then I think I, yeah, I did, because it shows it here. I showed how the advantage of that using that, it's a six inch uh, diameter wheel. I showed how I could, can you get a little closer, honey? And it, you can see a sheen on there of the front and the back. Can you see that? Uh, that is made possible by the fact that the wheel makes a concave groove into the front edge of the chisel. And then when you put it flat on a sharpening stone and grind it, it, uh, it only grinds the tip and the heel. And that makes it much easier and quicker to sharpen a tool like this. So that's one advantage I didn't explain last time. Well, now I'd like to explain a little bit about the sharpening stones that I use. These are uh, stones that uh, I got on the, <laughs> probably on the internet. They were, I suspect, made in Japan. They have Japanese characters on them. But uh, this one is equivalent to 800 grit sandpaper. And it's, this one is uh, equivalent to 1,000. So there are three different grades here. This is a, yet a finer one. And uh, I use these after I have used the wheel. And doing so, it, it polishes the front and the heel of the blade, making it much easier to do. I don't know whether you can see the reflection here, but there is a brighter uh, surface on the front and the back of this particular chisel. Well, that's the... That's so again the, the advantage of this kind of a grinding system and using stones of this sort. These are wet stones, I should add. They are in this tray because I normally add about a half inch of water in there and soak these stones until they look like they're pretty wet through. They're absorbent. Uh, and then, then I polish them not by putting the, the, the blade on the stone and, and wiggling the, the, the blade, but rather by putting this on a, a surface that I can support it and use the stone to grind against the blade. It's a little bit awkward with one like this, but it does work. And that I find I can control the uh, angle much better and I can get the feel of it better. Well, I wish you well with this. It's not easy. <laughs>